Hello there everybody and welcome along to episode number 86. Number 86 for second round of the Coral World Grand Prix. And we are going to be taking on the Hawk, Barry Hawkins. Uh, should be a good match. Uh, looking forward to seeing how uh, this goes because uh, I think the last time we played Barry he um, he got a bit drunk. Well I think he got a bit drunk. I don't uh, quite know uh, about that uh, if we're being honest but uh, with that being said <coughs> the introduction will be done. Everything is uh, ready in the arena. We are going to throw it over to uh, our MC and we are going to get uh, Elliot and Barry, those two boys, firmly, uh, firmly on the bays, folks. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. The first frame, Elliot Slesser to break. <sighs> Elliot gets us off and underway in the first frame against uh, Barry Hawkins. Didn't we meet Barry Hawkins in the same stage of the German Masters? I'm fairly confident we did. Oh, that's going to hit the yellow and then sneak behind the brown. So we've got him in the snooker already. Oh, this, this should be fun. This uh, should be very fun. With this shot. In fact, Barry Hawkins has already fouled. <laughs> Foul and a miss. Elliot Slesser. Oh, uh, yep. Keep, keep racking the, the points up, Barry. I, I don't mind. He could well leave an opportunity if he's not careful. Foul and a miss. Elliot Slesser. Yeah, four. go. Well, Put all them uh, balls the back together of there, Mr. Uh, Mr. Collier. There's a good chance he'll leave an opportunity for his opponent. Oh, he's got here. it this time. He may have left one. Well, I, I don't say he may have left one, he has left one, but uh, the problem is it's not going to be easy to get onto a colour. We may have to sacrifice the position on the black. Yes. Well, it depends. Let's see what uh, see what happens here. That's nicely in the pocket. No problems with the rest there. He didn't have to well set, sacrifice much position on the black. He can go one. for it. <clears throat> the only problem is going to be where his next red comes from. Well, he's taking it on to the left corner. Meh. Not quite the split he wanted. Eight. Good news is he's got one. That that's the good news. The bad news is he's he's got one. <laughs> this won't be easy. It's going to be using the red to uh, cannon off something here. Brilliant. He's going to go for the pink brilliant. here, I think. Not really the level of control he was after there. Lost the cue ball a little. it's going to be a pink ball, Nine. yes. It's going to be a pink. And then, presumably, he's going to stun into... Oh, he's going to he's go for the pack here. Power. Brilliant, Paul. Outstanding. They don't come much better. Well, look at that. One's popped out. What about there you that go. for a positional shot? <laughs> <clears throat> That's pretty good. 15. So we'll put uh, a bit of backspin uh, left hand side on this to play for the black. Decent position to take on Cue a ball here. Keeps spinning for a little uh, bit, just a little bit. Now he's on the black again. Bit of top. Oh, I think he was going for the pack there, but uh, miss, just missed the pack, unfortunately. He's still got one. The red next to the pink is available, but uh, it's not going to be easy to get onto a uh, colour. Let's see which uh, which colour he uh, on. ends up on here. It may be the pink again. Beautiful pot. It, indeed, it Excellent is. The reds have split there. up uh, very Pitch nicely. Perfect. Twenty-four. See He's what uh, he pop, ends up on the in the right shape middle. of a uh, red. <sighs> that lone one on the table Good. there, that looks uh, available. <clears throat> Indeed it is, in it goes. 31. Thirty-one. 
this looks really See what he does uh, here. Oh, a nice little nudge on the reds. Now, believe it or not, that's actually helped because okay. those reds have now gone in uh, straight positions. Off uh, two cushions to play for the black again. 39. That's a good split. Oh, nice collision. Here. Oh, and he's forced his way through. He's on a red. 46. I wonder if he's going to try... Uh, yeah, he's going to try and hold here for the uh, for the black. Oh, I think he just went right across the face of that... Uh, 47. <coughs> red there. Ooh, nice little connection there, but oh, he may be on this uh, one. He's just uh, come up to fifty-four. Yeah, that goes. That goes. Nice position on the black. Fifty-five. He's on the black. He's played that very well. 62. Ooh, but he's not on a red. Uh, well, he's going to have to play a, a diff... Well, this red here goes. And see that? <coughs> he's lucky. This looks pretty he's fortunate. Simple. He's also on the black again. Now if he keeps going at this uh, at this pace. The break he's gonna he's already got a one four seven to his name. He's going to Just get a one four required. six. If we and see an, oh goes. look at that connection! That should be that it. That was a connection. No real way for the pink is to win free, the frame now. But look at those reds 70. now, all in a line. Bit of stun run through here to get onto the he's black. To sink this into the Take right the corner. Take the middle of the. Uh, Good split. Two that will really uh, assist up here. better. Seventy-one <coughs> gives you a bit more uh, flexibility and a little more leeway. You may go for one of those He's reds uh, right corner, now yeah. as well. Black is in. And nice, in uh, nicely goes. enough the knuckle. Seventy-eight. Now, can he drop this into the right corner? Another red goes in. Down it goes. 79. It's going to put a nice bit of uh, right hand screw on this. He's going to power it over as well. Or at least try to. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> Believe it or not, he's going to get on the a red anyway. <laughs> Oh, uh, what a shot. <coughs> Excuse me. He's going to take this one. I personally would have took the one above these two reds here. Personally, but, uh, you know, Elliot's uh, preference. One, Let's see uh, how he plays it. Well, I think he went a bit too the hard draw. there. <coughs> we'll see uh, how that all uh, comes about. In goes the black. I think he can get if he can get the bottom of the free out the way. Ninety four. I have every confidence that uh, the other two will follow. Nice bit of stun run through for the black. Ninety five. <clears throat> now, how are you going to play this shot? Because you've got to come around shot. the angles here. Mulligan. Fantastic century. Well, the good news is he looks like he's on one of these reds. The bad news is he looks like two. he's on one of these reds. Playing for the middle pocket. I think he's going to give up on the 146 and aim for a 145 instead. To take on a here. 103. 
or a 144, which is still, I think you'll agree, that is still a hell of a contribution. This is not easy. In goes the blue. Tremendous pop. Brilliant. 108. And the red follows it. What a, what a reactive Nicely cue ball there now. Look where that yellow is. 109. That yellow's in a sort of uh, no man's land. Or no cue ball land, I should say. Hundred and sixteen. Just the colours now. That uh, cue ball went a bit far, but uh, never mind. He's looking to pop this into the right Might, corner. Might uh, recover it with this green. What a shot on the green a screw there as well. Hundred and twenty-one. Brown's in, stunned it over for the blue. 125. Tricky shot here. He's gonna stun it for the pink now. Into the middle pocket. What a great pot. That was a great shot. 130. And then stun down for the black and it'd be a break of 144 in the first frame. I like where this is uh, going already. What Great contribution. Amazing. Fantastic, and that is 1-0 uh, to Elliot Slesser. Frame. So, he's opened up a one-frame gap and will be looking to apply some pressure on his opponent in this frame. I agree. This is a great opportunity to really turn the screw on his opponent. Thank you. The second frame, Barry Hawkins to break. Not exactly the best break either from Barry. Well, uh, we'll have to see what uh, red room. Can we this get on the black no from giving. here? Great opening red. One. The answer is sort of. But, uh, yeah. I think we can get on the next red, not that's an easy uh, no one, problem. A half chance. Another red uh, pops out of the pack there. Position if you're hearing something in the background, no, it's not Eight. that uh, dog yapping. Ian's got um, some stuff for his uh, for his throat. Because he talks about this a uh, lot, he does seven recordings in a day sometimes. Which I think you'll uh, agree is quite a lot of recordings, especially in a short space of time. What a reactive cue ball! It's going to bounce off that red. Nice. Nine. So yeah, he's got. Um, he finds two things works for his throat: fluid, which uh, he's got a little bit of left, and chocolate. Specifically, white chocolate. Hmm. Sixteen. I don't think this uh, red would go. But turns out it does. Seventeen. So in goes the red. Twenty-four. Black's in now. Got to take this one. I think he's got to screw across the uh, face of this black here. <coughs> Don't know about you, but that's going towards the. Um, that's going towards the uh, the corner pocket. If you do that, he may even try and hold it to have it just stop right there where the red is. Something like that. 25. It does leave a more acute angle for this black, but the angle that it leaves 
is actually perfect. He's playing the pot here. To go into them reds. That's a really good split, and this is a real opportunity. He's on one. 32. Not brilliantly, but he is on one. What well, shot? Even with the rest. He's still in the black as well if he. Uh, 33. Fancies it. So, this pot into the right corner. Black's in. And he splits, splits the last of the reds me. open. That was a great connection. 40. He's going to take that one to the middle pocket. Because if you think about it, that one to the middle pocket actually does block a lot of the balls going into that middle pocket. It should be pretty straightforward. And i got a feeling that uh, that middle pocket is about to be used and abused. 41. That's it, now I'm out of fluid. Well, it may okay. not be used and abused. He's got uh, a few reds uh, he can play into the corner pockets here. He's going to play a power stun power. across the uh, table here. Does it get past that red? Yes, it does. 49. In goes the black. He's uh, on Played for the maximum. Well. He's already got a maximum 56. break in the last match against uh, Ali Carter, if you remember. Oh, he's going to go for a top corner red already. Just wants to sink this into the left corner pocket. Oh, rattled the pocket, but shot. thin. Well played. That's a wonderful, wonderful pot. It knocked on the door a few times 57. and then asked, uh, can I come in? Black goes in clean. Hmm. 64. He may have to play a plant here. But he's changed his mind. He's going to go for this red. And I think that's smart play. Because you can just stun it across the table and be on the black in the same uh, pocket. 65. Lovely bit of top to get through uh, the ball. Now. 72. Hmm. What do you play for here? You can play this into the middle pocket. I don't think he's uh, going to like what uh, Reddy's on when he gets Important there. Important pot here. In it goes. And that effectively shuts out his opponent in this frame. He may have to give up the maximum. 73. He's not going to. I mean, that red was game ball, effectively. So, it's a free punt. Thank you, pot. No doubt. Impressive it's in. Shot with the rest. I tell you what, that red goes past the green. That's oh shot. Eighty. Now he's got a problem here. I know what he's going to do here. Unfortunately, he's going to careen off that green. Which is why he's changing his mind. Oh, he can't even get through to that red. Off the uh, off the blue. He's going back to this red. If he gets no contact on the green, he'll be in perfect position. But I've got a feeling he will. Yeah, there's the green. But it's a good contact. Look at that. It's come back to the black. And the greens have got back on his spot. That was precise play. 81. Hmm. 
88. In goes the black. It's going to stun this red in. Now you got the difficult... The easier of the three reds is that one over the middle pocket. If he gets on it, brilliant. But if not, save it. He's going to take the one on the 96. cushion here. Or is he? Yeah, he's going to take the one on the cushion. He had to, really, because... In it goes. It, it was the only one he could play 97. for. It really, really was the only one on a lot he could uh, play for. What a century that is. So that black goes in now. We can't play for that one. So we're going to take this one along the cushion. And he's just going to well, roll it in. Potting this into the right no hassle, the no fuss. In it goes. Great shot. 105. Playing mm. this with a lot of power. Fantastic connection. Does he get high? I think he has. Cue ball stop spinning. There you go. And he's got high. That is fantastic. So. Now is the moment of truth. What angle do you have on the black? Oh, it's going to be a bit... Nasty one. 130. Oh, it's going to be a nasty one. It's going to slow roll this black in. To try and get on the yellow. And when you don't commit to these ones, they're uh, a bit tricky. Shall we say enough said? Not an easy one, but a half chance. Outstanding pot. That's Don't go I over the brown. Don't go near the brown. That's pet. That is perfect. 120. <clears throat> the maximum is on. Just the colours to go. It's going to stun this into the cushion. Hope you get nicely on the green to. 122. Uh... Oh, yeah, that's perfect. He can just stun this in. Like that. Stun the brown in. Bit of top spin. Can he get... Ooh, he's a bit high. He's way too high on this blue. <clears throat> he may have to look to play this to a middle pocket. He's playing this into the right centre pocket. It won't be a middle pocket. Well, it will be a middle pocket. It's a bit of an acute angle, though. 134. No one's ever done two 147s in the same tournament. Elliot, Elliot might be about to do it himself He's here. taking this on to the right middle. In goes the pink. And he's lovely on the black. So, for another... Well, I say he's lovely on the black. It's a bit acute. But uh, you fancy him for it. So here we go. This for the 147. In it goes. What a shot. It's another 147 break by impressive. Elliot Slesser. And he's gone 2 0 in and front. That's extended his lead. And this will be worrying for his opponent. Thank you. The third frame. Elliot Slesser to break. Uh, Elliot breaks off in the third frame. This should be. Uh, Academic from here, it's gone the wrong side of the yellow. Stuart with the uh, safety shot. Ooh, now does that red go? Oh, I tell you what, 
the red goes, but oh, <laughs> I tell you what, that's going to be close. He may have to. He may have to do what he's doing here. Swerving in. This may go wrong. In fact, he's actually not playing that shot. He's going to just nestle up to the pack here. Barry. Did I say Stuart before? It's not. It's Barry. Where did I get Stuart from? <laughs> I don't know. So we're going to have a tappy tap session here now. Nothing wrong though with a good tappy tap session. Hmm. That one doesn't pop. No matter how much spin you put on it, to Elliot, that ain't gonna pop. <coughs> yeah, I would go that way. Head towards the pink there, because uh, nothing, uh, nothing could go wrong if you nudge the pink. I don't think he'll be on one. Well, this is building up to be a really interesting test of their safety skills. No, I didn't think he'd be on one as well. But I tell you what, Barry was not tempted by this red to the middle. Elliot's tempted. Elliot's well, tempted. He's taking it on. Elliot's tempted. That is a quality opening red. <laughs> One. That's uh, in, as they would say. As uh, somebody sneezed uh, there. Nice little run through shot. Is, he, is that white going in? No, it's going to stay in the pocket just. Is he on? I'm hoping he's on this red. He is. But he may have to play it slow. To try and uh, stay corner, on the black. Oh, he didn't play it slow. He played it at pace. Excellent I appreciate that. Good shot. Nine. Now. What do you do here? He'll play with plenty of power. Well, he's gone in. That's not what he was hoping He for. may have one. One of these ones 16. to the side here might uh, pot. Well, I'm saying might pot. They will pot. Will pot, fill pot. Gonna try and stun it past he's the face the of this here. red. He does oh, as well. Shot Great is. shot. Oh, is it the school run time? Here. 17. Genius at work. That's Even that guy agrees split. with me. You'll be unlucky if he's not on anything here. There's another. That's a proper split. Now, I tell you what. I've seen a red. I wonder if Elliot's Pretty seen cool. it. No, he hasn't. I was thinking that red that's now... Uh, Basically to the left of the pink, he into the top corner. Nice. That red's in. He's on the black he's again. Playing very well here. If he's straight, he might play for that one under the black. But he's not quite straight. So he'll probably play for one of these two that are uh, just above it here, i.e. nearest to you uh, now as you look at it. <coughs> Nicely done. 32. This should be straightforward enough. In goes the red. 33. In the black's in. Oh, that's a bit 
Uh, now he may have to take a red to the corner. Now the screw, yeah, there you go. The if he screws it between these reds, he Half should be on the black here. again. What a fabulous <coughs> pop that is! Now I don't, well, I don't want to say have it. Played that any better? Superb positional shot. But six reds, six blacks. What do you want? <laughs> We've seen two one four sevens in the same tournament. We have never seen two one four sevens in the same match. 48. And Elliot's already done a one four four and a one four seven in the previous two frames. Doesn't want to ever hit this. Could it be quite possible? Well, he's lost. He few does it touch. again. Would have wanted that under better control, really. 49. The form that he's in would suggest yes. But that's the form 56. that he's in. Just got to take one of these reds in the bulk end now. Because he didn't get on uh, one nicely there. Fifty-seven. He's not on the black. Ooh, ho, 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 ho. that's unlucky. So now he's got to go for the one four six. He's attempting to sink this into the left corner pocket. Pinks in. Beautifully done. Oh, wonderful shot. Sixty-three. He's aiming for the left corner here. Mm. What a top shot that is. What a wonderful pass. Nice bit of stun run through. 64. To get onto the black. <clears throat> and back in position, essentially. It's all a case of which red he's going to play for in a minute. Because uh, I don't think he knows which red he's uh, going to play for here. 71. But it's going to be uh, this one into the corner. Just the red. Just uh, run here. it through plain ball. Down it goes. I'm a little low, but that's uh, good. That should be it. Get on one of those. Uh, Seventy-two reds into the uh, corner pocket. He's actually going to nudge one. Well, he tried to nudge it to hold it, but uh, that didn't happen. I tell you what, he may take that one in the bulk end. He's going to. I think that was a great uh, choice there. Now, can he drop this into the right corner? Tremendous Good spot. shot. And he's come down nicely for the black as well. 80. Play for the one under the black. You got to really, haven't you? This could be your best chance. 87. No real problem here. Go play a plain ball as well. Eighty-eight. Bit of top on this uh, white to try and get round for a red. I'm not sure if that one above the pink goes 95. past the pink. It's going to be close. But I think it uh, just doesn't. That's a uh, good white. Now it's all going to be a case of... He's looking to pop this into the left corner pocket. Fantastic century. What uh, what white he gets, and he's got good white. 103. He's going for the left corner pocket. That's an excellent pop. 
The only problem is he's not got a good white off this black. 104. So we're going to have to play a lot of top to try and hope he gets a good angle. Mm. I think that was asking a bit too much there. 111. I mean, he can try and well, hold for it if he wants, but corner. I don't think he'll be able to. Tremendous well, shot. Well, I didn't think he would. My only query is, look where that uh, look where that yellow is. He's aiming for the left corner here. Can he pot that? Hundred and nineteen. <coughs> he can a shot just the colours left now to try and screw around the angles here oh dear well actually if you think about it that's not actually too bad 121 well it goes half a chance here What a magnificent pop. Green's in, and look at that position on the brown. So, let's recap this match, because he won this match. Elliot's had breaks of 144, 147, and 146. 128. That... There's only really one word to describe that kind of form, and that is... He's an expert long potter, and he's taking this on. What a wonderful pot. 133. He's looking to pop this into the right corner. In goes the pink. Black for a 146 to go with the 144 and the 147, which means he scored, if you think about it, a lot of points without reply. Fantastic clearance. Brilliant. I mean, what, what can you say? Frame and match, Elliot Stresser. That takes him into the quarterfinals. Well played. What, what can you say to that, guys? I mean, look how many unanswered points that is. 444. Whew. That kind of form should win Elliot the World Grand Prix. But will it win in the World Grand Prix? Only time's going to tell, folks. Let's see who we get in round three, shall we? Yeah, me. Well, that was easy as you like. Not going to uh, argue on that one, folks. And uh, next up in the quarterfinal of the Coral World Grand Prix, it's going to be the world number three, Mark Selby, who we beat, if you remember, in the final of the German Masters. So this should be a piece of piss. But guys, 15 likes. Let's go for it. And you can subscribe for more daily Snooker 19, Monster Energy Supercross, F1 2019 and NASCAR He4 Korea Mode videos, as well as other live streams available throughout the week when you hit the notification bell. And when you do that, you find out when a new episode goes live and when we put a new career mode up straight away. But until next time, we will see everybody behind the bulk line in the next video.